Hey guys, in this video I want to talk to you about how to ask for referrals and get them easily. This is a simple growth hack you should be deploying in your business no matter where you are in your growth strategy. This is something beginners should be doing and intermediates and absolutely advanced marketers are using this for sure in their businesses. Alright, I'm going to hop off screen and walk you through this presentation. Alright, so take it from Mark, right? A trusted referral is the holy grail of advertising. There's literally nothing else you can do in your business that is going to build that type of trust. Having somebody that know, likes, and trusts you introduce you to their friend and say that you're somebody they should do business with. So we need to take advantage of this. This needs to be part of your growth plan using this in your business. All right, so why are referrals so important? Well, 92% of consumers trust referrals from people they know. 77% of consumers are more likely to buy a new product when learning about it from their friends or their family, right? So you need to expand the way you look at your business. Word of mouth is the primary factor behind 20 to 50% of all purchase decisions. All right, so what does this mean? Your referral process is a key component of your attraction strategy. It allows you to leverage your ideal clients to attract even more quality clients for your business. So how do you do it? Well, the best way to do it is to set expectations with all new clients that after you deliver that wow service for them, you're going to ask them for a referral. So this won't be a surprise after you deliver that wow experience that you come to them and ask for a referral. So that's something I would recommend putting into place for all new clients coming into your business. You have to have a system in place to ask for referrals. And I'd start by asking your best clients. Don't wait till the end of the engagement. The best time to ask is when you've delivered that wow result. Even if it's not finished yet, if the client says, wow, I'm really happy, bam, that's the time to hit them with the request for a referral. Use the personal touch, right? You want to use a phone call or a video or an email, but you want to make sure you tie it back to the results you delivered for that client. Be specific. Don't be generic. If you ask for a referral, don't ask them to just send you digital marketing clients. Be specific about something you're doing for them in their business. If you're doing Facebook ads for them and driving leads that way, ask them to refer some of their friends who could benefit from Facebook ads because that person's going to feel way more inclined to give you a referral for a service that you're already delivering for them and, you know, giving them that wow experience. All right, so how do you do it? Make it easy for your clients to refer to you by pre-drafting an email they can use. I'm going to add a download link to this video. If you're interested in getting my free template, I'm happy to send it out to you. Just click the link, fill in your name, and my team will send it to you. And if you're getting something from this video, please take a moment right now. Just give me the thumbs up so I know that you like this content. I'll continue to make more of it in the future. All right, so other things to consider to increase your referrals. You should also consider offering incentives to your clients who refer to another client. Things like gift cards and thank you cards, um, free work. There's all kinds of incentives that you can give to people. People are motivated by different things. You've got to experiment for your business and find what works for you. Ensure follow up with all referrals. The worst thing you can do is not successfully follow up, right? If somebody refers business to you and it doesn't work out, close that loop. Go back, thank them for the referral, let them know that it didn't work out with John because of, you know, whatever reason, but that you appreciate the referral and you hope that they'll continue to send people they think that would be a good fit to do business with you. And then give referrals right? Always be on the lookout for ways to help your clients by referring business to them. You know, that, that takes advantage of the law of reciprocity, right? If you're going to give referrals, people are going to feel inclined to want to give you referrals. All right, so give it a try. With only 11% of other business owners out there asking for referrals, you can separate yourself from the pack, right? So when you get rid of the excuses, all of a sudden you start to have that success. So I would encourage you to just Add this to your system so that no matter who is coming into your business, you're setting that expectation after you deliver that wow experience that you're going to be asking for referrals. And I would start asking your existing clientele, will they refer some of their friends to you? Make sure you download my free template. I'll show you exactly what we're sending out to our clients to get referrals. 
I hope you got something from this video. If you did, definitely hit the subscribe button. Leave a comment or a question below. I'm happy to engage with you here on the channel. And if you haven't done it yet, give me that thumbs up on the channel. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you in the next video.